Collective, hey, welcome to Chakra Energy Readings. I am Sharika and thank you for stopping by. I am here only as a vessel to facilitate a positive connection with our ancestors and spirit guides. I ask that the ancestors and spirit guides of pure love and light guide us on a healing journey of our chakra energy that will ultimately bring us into understanding and complete oneness with all. We thank you, God, for our ancestors and spirit guides. And we give you the utmost gratitude for our being. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining us. We are doing the reading for Pisces. Hope everyone is well. We are in the first quarter moon. Uh, the first quarter moon is the take action moon. Please keep that in mind when you hear your reading. A few more announcements. We um, have added meditation videos for each of the chakras. On there, there's a 15 minute, a three hour, and then overnight. Um, please use according to your reading. Also, I have the started a chakra therapy where I focus on one chakra a week. Uh, this week it is the heart chakra, which is green. Um, and if you would like to join me, I will be doing the meditation meditations from the heart chakra playlist. And lastly, I have started an Instagram for uh, chakra energy readings. I will be focusing on what card draws daily and the energy for the week, as I said, which is heart chakra. So let's get started. deck we have spiritual awakening in the upright all right so the first card out is the heart chakra love and reverse second card out is heart chakra play and reverse third card out is sacral chakra flexibility in reverse 
fourth card out is self mastery, uh, and that is solar plexus in reverse. Fifth card out is soul healing, and this is from the soul star chakra, which is since they entered above our head, and that is a reverse. This card also is from the soul star chakra, and that's angels and masters in reverse. And lastly, we have the throat chakra listening in reverse. So we do have one upright card that would be the spiritual awakening card at the bottom of the deck. Underneath, underneath that, we have creativity in the upright, which is from our uh, sacral chakra. And then we have nurturing in the upright from the... Um, Mother Earth grounding chakra, which is six to eight inches below our feet. So let's see what we have here. Um, I see stagnant, stuck energy. Everything is in reverse, except spiritual awakening creativity, and nurturing. So you're going through a spiritual awakening because you are going through a spiritual awakening. You are stuck and stagnant. Um, pretty much a spiritual awakening, that is, is, that's what it is. You do not move. You are stuck and stagnant. Uh, to think about life choices and decisions that you have made. Um, creativity is in the upright, nurture is in the upright, which means you have love and you are able to create and produce for yourself. So you're able to live, produce, um, show love and caring energy, but spiritually you are stuck. Let's see what we have in the Chakra Wisdom cards. And let's see, this is... Uh, we do have all of the Chakras out. We have... This is Root Chakra with Abundance in Reverse. This is uh, Sacral Chakra with Flexibility in Reverse. So... Um, Solar plexus chakra, self mastery in reverse. The heart chakra, love and play in reverse. Throat chakra, listening in reverse. Um, you do have the uh, third eye chakra, spiritual awakening, and the upright. I'm sorry, that is the crown chakra. Third eye is not out here. So intuition is not out here, which tells me that is being blocked. I don't see it anywhere. I'm going to take that as intuition is being blocked. You are in a stuck state in a state. Um, and this is a spiritual awakening. You are trying to figure out a way with this creativity card. You are using that creativity, so that means you are trying to figure out a way. There is nurturing in the upright, so there is love, care there, and spiritual awakening. But looks like that's what it is. A stuck, stagnant energy. I'm trying to figure out your next move. Wanting to possibly show love, but not sure how. And it says, in spirit, God, please give a, a shot of wisdom cards. So, all right, three right out. So, we have crown chakra, spiritual awareness, uh, third eye chakra wisdom and discernment finally that's the only third eye chakra we got out here and heart chakra acceptance of self all right so crown chakra spiritual wellness awareness 
When the mind sways negatively, remind yourself of love, truth, gratitude, and spirit. You are the observer of your thoughts and do not let them bring you down. Your thoughts are the closest thing to God. Your thoughts are the closest thing to God. Remind yourself to have a gratitude and acceptance for what is and to have courage of your convictions. Continually pursue a clear understanding of spiritual truths behind all that is and all that is unfolding. Ask yourself, is what I'm thinking the truth? And is it having a positive or negative impact on my life? So you, like I said, you are in a stuck, stagnant state and you're not sure what decision to make. There is love. There is just not sure what um, movement to make. And this all is bringing you into a new spiritual awakening. Second card, wisdom and discernment. Be open, Bruno, please. Be open to understand the spiritual truths behind the situation occurring in your life right now. Offer your wisdom to assist others along their path. Trust in the highest source to guide you and to help others who ask for your guidance. Practice discernment and listen deeply within for the truth. Choose to respond to rather than just re reaching to. Let me reread that. Choose to re respond to rather than just reacting to situations, acting with clarity courage and conviction stand on what you believe in stand on what you know to be true to yourself the last card is acceptance of self I just said that it's time to rejuvenate yourself by giving yourself love Accept yourself the way you are and remind yourself that you cannot feel any better about life than how you feel about yourself. You will not wait a moment longer to accept yourself. Honor what your body is asking for. And if you are unsure, you will ask yourself, what can you do to be healthier and more balanced than you are now? Dwell upon all that is right in your life, not what is wrong, and have gratitude. Accept your life as it is now and move forward from there. All right, again, to recap, there is a stagnant energy here um, that seems to be going through a, a spiritual awakening. That spiritual awakening does embody nurturing and creativity love caring compassion and ideas but you are unable to move forward in that so spirit ancestors are seeing to come within yourself going within yourself have spiritual awareness um, use your wisdom and discernment and accept who you are and the decision that you make all right, I hope I was able to help a Pisces today. You all take care. We do have midweek coming with one card draw for each sign. And then, um, like I said, uh, meditation is definitely needed for um, going within. That will be a third eye chakra. If you are interested in stones, clear quartz is a really good one to have. That is just a clear little stone that you can tumble in your hand, put in your pocket, um, and just help to um, allow you to get in a clarity within and possibly move forward. Also, please use the meditation list, playlist that we have to help you in your journey. All right. Take care. See you soon. Bye.